We're here in, in Amsterdam, in the city of Amsterdam, in the neighborhood of Eiberg, which is a relatively new neighborhood. And we are actually in a residential building. We're in an office space underneath a residential building. Uh, behind us is our first growth of lettuces in unused office spaces under LED using hydroponics. We, we're trying out lots of different plants. Uh, we believe in a polyculture. So right now we're growing uh, Lola Rosa, which is a um, very nice red lettuce and uh, endive, and a green uh, lettuce and a red oak lettuce. It's a good question. Why, why office buildings and, and why housing? There are existing structures. So when you're looking at sustainability problems, sometimes it's the best thing to do is say, wait, there's, there's something that's already there. Let's see if we can use that opposed to building an entirely new structure. And growing the food in the cities means that there's no, no use of oil for transportation, no storage. We don't use any pesticides or preservatives. It's not shipped anywhere. It's consumed local for local within the city, which we think is a great advantage uh, for people living in the city. Because this idea of vertical farming has been around for quite a long time, but everybody has been doing a lot of big architectural drawings and scaling it in, in huge tower blocks. And we believe the best way to do it is start small and start practical. So, so this is what we're doing. We're building a pilot, we're proving the concept, and then we're scaling. And you learn so much by actually doing, rather than uh, having the idea and uh, just trying to do it on a much grander scale.